Hey, hi, my name is Neil and I'm going to be your instructor for this course on Python for Six Sigma professionals. If you're either a Six Sigma green belt or a black belt, a certified or proficient green belt or black belt, I'm sure you would find this course very useful. So what is this course about? We all know that data science is a skill in demand and Python is one of the most popular tools which is used in data science. As Six Sigma professionals, you already have a very good level of proficiency when it comes to data analysis. I'm sure you know how to create histograms, box plots, run various hypothesis tests, create models, scatter diagrams. So you know all those things which you can do either using Excel or using Minitab. But the world is moving towards Python, mainly because Python is a programming language so it's possible for you to do wonders with a programming language rather than just a software application. And it's also open source. So the purpose of this course is to get you onboarded into this Python programming language for data science. So that's simply the purpose of this course. At the end of this course, you will be in a position to run all those analytics that you already know, such as a histogram, maybe a descriptive statistics, box plots, normality tests, various hypothesis tests, run chart, and talking about modeling. So we will know scatter diagrams. We will talk about correlation, regression. So all these tools that you are already familiar with, we will use Python to create the outputs. At the end of this course, you would be very comfortable in doing that. You don't need to be a programmer. You can start from scratch. I'm going to help you install Python in your computer and then we will take the baby steps and as we progress, we will learn everything together. In addition to that, the way I've also structured this course is at the end of the course, I've included one end-to-end -end case study where you will have complete visibility of using all the tools together for one scenario. So that can give some more insights to you. And more importantly, all those files that I'm going to work with, the Python files, would be available for you for download. You could download them in your local system and you can try out and find out if you're getting the same answer. I will also include a couple of extra data files so you can practice and improve your proficiency there as well. So there's a lot to learn and I feel this is a very important course for all those Six Sigma professionals because at the end of the day, you don't want to be left behind just because you don't know a programming language. So that's the very purpose of this course. Wish you all the best. And if you have any doubts, feel free to reach out to me and I'll do my best to help you. Thank you.